Hey everybody, we're back. I'm Mike, this is Ed, and it is game day, but I'm not supposed to mention football at all, so I'm not going to, but the Badgers are on. Sorry. <laughs> all right. Hey, Eddie, I love you very much. <laughs> I like that this is a this is a running joke now. <laughs> yeah, well, uh, you know, it's the season open. Oh, okay. And I'm not sure what school. Yeah. So, okay. University of Southern. Florida. Yes. Yes. He's been excited about this for a, a little while now. Yeah. So, hey, we're opening up game day correctly. Yeah, okay. Yard. So. Triticum Straight Wheat Whiskey from A.D. Laws in Colorado. Uh, so this particular one, um, this A.D. Laws, we can't really get here in Wisconsin. Uh, Eric and I, when we were in Colorado, grabbed this at their distillery. Um, we got there. What? Dallas, Colorado. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's somewhere. Over that there, way. Over there. Uh, um, but... We, yeah, we got there at like 5 o'clock right as they were closing. So, but luckily we got to have a taste. <laughs> I want three of those, two of them. Yeah. Ten of those, six of them. Um, so, yeah, so this is their straight wheat whiskey. This is a neck pour. Neither of us have had this before. Um, so, take that with a grain of salt, that, but here we go. Nice. Ooh. I like the stopper, too. It's a big, you can big get your stopper. hand on that. Yeah. So, this, I believe, so this is a 375. I think this ran us around 30. Okay. Um... Which, you know, I think for craft distilling is, you know, I mean, it's expensive, but it's not bad. Right. Um, and depending it, on the product. True. <laughs> and it is 100% Colorado grown common wheat, um, aged no less than two years. Okay. Yep. So this, this is two years old. 50% alcohol. It's got a bit of color to it. So this sure is good. Does. Yeah. 53 gallon white oak barrels. Yeah. Uh, yeah, looks good. I don't much care for color analysis. <laughs> like, if you're blind tasting, I get it, but yeah. Uh, I'm going to say not too oily. Oh. Hmm. Wheat. Yeah. That <laughs> is <it's> bready. <laughs> that is <laughs> really bready. There's a hint of like green spices, almost like an apple. Green, yeah, yeah. So green, there's green, a, a green apple. Green there's apple. a tartness there. There's yeah, a tartness there. Um, kind of tart, kind of kind of like rosemary almost. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. For sure. He's got the better sniffer. <laughs> <laughs> We blame your allergies, remember? Oh, that's yeah. right. It is the season. Yep. It smells a little young. Like, it, it's got a, it's a little raw, youthful. But that's, a, I don't think that's a no, bad it's not thing. not horrible. Yeah. Yeah. Like, no, nothing stands out like a couple of the last ones. Right yeah, right. Yeah, it's a little fruity, little, little spicy. It smells, it smells good. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that goes down pretty easy. Yeah, very. It's a little, it's a little hot on the finish. Yeah, but but it and it's a little thin on taste compared yeah. to a heavy bourbon. True, true. <laughs> it doesn't, it doesn't have those big corn sweetness. No, 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 notes. no, no heavy. Well, I'm not. I'm going to say no heavy oaky notes either. No, no. This is. It's kind of just a light, light. Toffee sweetness, and then just a little bit of that kind of tart fruit taste. Just a little bit, just a tiny, tiny little bit of that tart fruit um, on the finish, and maybe yeah, but it's mostly just bready, right? Sure, yeah. I'm gonna compare this like if you had an ale and a vice beer. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> this would be the vice. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, totally. Well, and that's that's kind well, of it's not bad. I, yeah, it's just different. It's kind of what wheat whiskey is, though. It's like, because that's why weeded bourbons tend to be a little bit friendlier and nicer than the rye version, because the, the wheat gives it a little bit more sweet breadiness as opposed to the rye, which is spicy and fruity, right? Um, and actually, like, in Canada, back when, they only made wheat whiskey for a long time. They called it just common whiskey. And then they started adding rye because they were like, wait, this is way spicier and more thick. Yeah, some character. Yeah. 
Um, I think this is, this is nice. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Maybe, I mean, I think they could probably age a little bit longer. Maybe just a couple, like a year. Or five. Yeah. <laughs> a couple more years. But, uh, because there's a touch of youngness there, but overall, it's pretty, pretty, pretty much just fine. I don't think there's anything really offensive about it. Nope. Yeah. Nope. This is one I would start with after work. Mm. <laughs> In fact, I'll bet you this would go really good with ice. Let's find out. Oh, well, let's find out. <laughs> I wasn't doing anything. <laughs> or did you take some or something? I might have been you know, taking a run. Oh, of course you did. <laughs> <laughs> this will be fun to finally <laughs> go back and watch the... <laughs> All right. Hi. Hi. We're back. My silliness is over. You'll never see it. I don't. Maybe we will. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be watching this. I'm gonna be editing this afterwards. So I'm gonna find out what you did. <laughs> uh, okay. But yeah. Okay. We got a little little ice. Mm-hmm. Um, We're still sipping the wheat whiskey. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Wow. That that really just covers up that youthful, that kind of yeah, green leaves, youthful note. Leaves the wheat. Yeah. It's just weedy. Just very weedy and sweet. Hmm. Yeah. I like this even more. Yeah. This is the after dinner drink with yeah. ice. Like I don't think this is Or the pre dinner drink with ice. I don't think lunchtime. I don't think this is like <laughs> okay, fine. Uh <laughs> this isn't my go to like really complex, crazy, cool oh. whiskey. No. Um I don't know if it's for the price we paid what what would I say, like thirty? I think it was like thirty to forty. Somewhere in there. Um, it may be, that might be a, I mean, it's a little expensive for what you're getting, maybe, just because it doesn't, it doesn't rock my world. No. But. You know what? This is one you pull out, you say, you got to try this, because it's so different. It is. Yeah, it's, it's very different. Yeah. It does, it's and not, not bad different. No. No, not like some. Right. No, this is, this is cool. This is cool. I like, I like the fact that they're doing, they're, they're not going for, they're doing something more subtle. It's more subtle, it's more delicate, it's a little, it's less, uh, 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 the big, ridiculous flavor that we whis- whiskey hipsters tend to love. <laughs> okay, try it again. Okay. And tell me what you're getting. You thought it was bready before. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's a, it's a dark wheat. Mm-hmm. It's like dark honey bread. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, it's like, yeah, honey, bread, butter, still a little bit of that kind of tartar fruit, maybe just a touch, but for the most part, yeah. yeah. It's, I think, yeah, I think with a little more age, I think this would be really cool. Oh, yeah. So, so. yeah. Okay. All right. So, if that was good us from the Rocket Review. Did, did we tell them everything they need to know about that? I think so. If you have any questions, let us know. Or just go ask 80 Laws out of them. You know? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you can them too. I have them send you some. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, um, I think a pretty good distribution. I know we've, we've got, we can get their bourbon and rye here in Wisconsin, which we will also be doing. We've got a sample pack of those. At some point, we'll have those on the channel as well. Cool. Um, but we want to start out with the wheat. All right. So. But, anyway, until next time. Yeah, hey, stay tuned. And, uh, tune in, uh, turn on, and, no, um. <laughs> Come on, you know this. What, what do they need to do, Pop? They need to like, they need to subscribe, they need to view and watch and tell friends, and they need to uh, comment. comment. There we go, there comments. we go, all right. And they need to enjoy whiskeys. Yes. Like we do. Yes. And they need to let us know what they're drinking so yes. we can try it, too. Yes! Oh, there's so much to do all those things. Yeah. Oh, man, yes. So, and most importantly, stay rotten. Yeah. <laughs>